Monroe County leaders hope a $5 million infusion of cash will help alleviate the hospital backlog, a problem referred to as a crisis by Monroe County Hospital administrators and other health care providers in the past few weeks. Right now, people who are in the emergency room spend hours and sometimes days languishing in chairs and beds and in hallways because there are no beds available in the inpatient units. All four hospitals are full every single day, largely because of unprecedented numbers of hospitalizations that are occurring and people languishing because they cannot move into nursing home beds. The money is part of the Federal American Rescue Plan Act and would be used as an incentive to get nursing homes in a 13 county region to accept patients with acute medical needs and or intense mental health or behavioral health care needs for nursing homes so if they took these difficult to place patients uh, they would be that would the idea is that would reduce the capacity burden on the hospitals and this would provide a financial uh, incentive for the nursing homes uh, to take those patients prior to approving the funding Monroe County legislators questioned whether or not this would be a long-term or short short-term fix they also asked about guarantees to ensure nursing homes would take on the so-called hard to place patients who are taking up bed space in hospitals awaiting nursing home placement staff told them the proposal is modeled after a successful program in Syracuse and that nursing homes get the money once they accept the patients